cinnamon ounce pour. <sighs> yes, I'm bored. <laughs> anyway, hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am here with week 16 of my Q and A a day journal. <sighs> and it's day 511 of our stay at home order. So, you know, before we even get started, I just wanted to say um I wasn't going to get real made up and be fronting like I'm doing something outside of staying in the house. So, I got my little, ooh, I think a little, a little messy. <laughs> anyway, I got my sweats on. As you see, my hair, gray hair is coming through. So, I, I haven't even dyed my hair yet. But I'm keeping it real. I'm keeping it real. I didn't even put that much makeup on. I don't like showing my dark circles now. I tried my best, but I just did minimal makeup. I didn't get all dressed up or any little cute little t-shirts. And I haven't dyed my hair. So this is it. What you see is what you get. <laughs> anyway, we're going to get started and if this isn't week 16, which I should have checked, I will definitely put something up here and uh, correct any mistake <laughs> that I made on that. So let's see. We are on Monday, April 13th. And the question is, what is your favorite thing to do on a Sunday morning? I love to sleep until 11. I always said, tell my kids, don't call me till after 11 o'clock. First, I said 10.30, and so they'd like 10.30 on the dot, my phone was ringing. So now I can try to give myself that little half hour leeway because rest assured, my phone's going to be ringing at 11. But um, I love to just sleep in, and I love to cook a nice breakfast. I love pancakes. So pancakes, eggs, maybe even some um, breakfast potatoes, that's my thing to do on a Sunday that I love. And, and they look for my kids when they're here, look forward to it. And my husband, uh, sort of too, he, he's, he's not a big eater lately. So anyway, uh, Tuesday, April 14th, the question is, if you could acquire a talent without any extra effort, what would it be? Singing, singing. I love to sing. If I haven't said it before, I love to sing, but I can't sing a lick. So that would be, oh, that would be my dream. I would, people would be so sick of me because I would sing everything. I would just sing, sing, sing. Anyway, Wednesday, April 15th, the question is, what celebrity would you want to interview? Um... I have a lot, a lot of, of um, celebrities that I'd love to interview. I wrote like someone like Rihanna, uh, Halle Berry, Prince, uh, Prince, yes, yes, Prince, Smokey Robinson, um, Maya Angelou, Obama, Nick Cannon. There's so many people that I would love to interview. So, um, the next question, Thursday. Um, April 16th, what's a political issue that interests you? Homelessness, um, affordable housing, <sighs> oof, gentrification, uh, racial disparities, you name it. I'm, I'm, I work in government and so I get very, um, I feel very close to a lot of these issues. And um, I hope that someday I am able to uh, do things to make a difference in a lot of these um, these issues that we're having today, especially as black folk. Uh, Friday, April 17th, the question is, what do you think is your biggest shortcoming? Sticking with something. So me doing this, uh, 
to week 16, 16, 17. I hope it's 16. I keep saying that. But me doing this for this long, like I'm really, really um, trying to be strict and keeping myself on point with this. Uh, but yeah, that eating, uh, my, my eating habits, exercise habits, I just need to stick with some things. If I, I could stick with these things, I would be amazing. I'd be amazing, y'all. I'm already, you know, I'm already, you know, okay, but I would be like the bomb, all right? I, do people say the bomb anymore? I don't know, but I would still be the bomb anyway. Uh, Saturday, April 18th, the question is, write down a problem you solved today. Well, my daughter has been making um, masks for people, uh, and she couldn't find elastic anywhere, so... I went on a mission. It was like a challenge for me. And I actually found elastic at the dollar store. You know, those little cute little wings or uh, like bumblebee type um, wings that the little girls wear. Well, they had them in the Dollar Tree and they had elastic for them to put them on like this. So I bought a bunch of them, cut the elastic off and sent it to her. So problem solved. And Sunday, April 19th, it says, what famous person would you bring back from the dead to have dinner with? Anybody who knows me, hands down knows that it would be Prince. It would be Prince. If I could just spend a day, an hour or two with him, definitely would do so. Anyway, that was it for the week. Um, as always, it went fast. Um, there's really no look to discuss unless you care about my little Nike uh, <laughs> sweatsuit. Um, and my minimal, I mean, this is it today. I, mean, I take hats off. I mean, outside of some lighting, this is what you get. And I need, you know, my skin is not doing so well being in the house so much. So I really need to... If there's a, a PSA that I would say, you know, practice good skincare when you're indoors because you're not getting as much sun as you usually do. And I'm realizing that even though some people have to stay out of the sun, you still need some sun. My skin has just been a mess and I really need to take extra care of it since we've been stuck in the house. So stay safe, stay healthy, stay home. And if you can't stay home, stay six feet apart. God bless you.